creativity is any source of an outlet. It's, it's, it's having something inside of you, doing something, and then not having it inside of you anymore. Um, whether that be in music, in writing, in anything. Um, it, ne it doesn't necessarily have to make sense at all. It just has to be some sort of, out some sort of outlet. And by, by having it to be that outlet, it will resonate with other people. So the first thing is always getting a subject matter, like having an idea of what you want to paint. Um, so like right now it's still life, um, but before that you're always going to have an idea of exactly what it is you want to paint and envision how it's meant to look. Um, so what, after you have that idea, you then work on the composition, which is quite a big thing. It's rearranging where things need to go. It's basically transferring what you see in front of you onto a canvas. Um, which is actually a lot more challenging than you think. It's actually, for me, it can be sometimes harder than the actual painting part of it. Let the brush do the work and just work your brush, work the painting. Um, get the right colors in. I don't know, besides that, it's pretty much a, it sounds just like a simple process, but it can get quite tough, I guess. But yeah. It's like when you're swimming on like a lot of lengths and you get into a motion of like be un like you're unaware of what you're doing but you just like you're doing all these strokes and your mind kind of wanders off um, and you get into this zone uh, into like a specific mindset and that's like the best and I think you for it. I knew a time, I knew a place that felt a lot like you. And it's just one of those things like the more you do it, the more you get to love it, the more you learn. And like the more you learn and more you know about it, the the more like the passion grows. So yeah.